Welcome to Chemistry Tutorial 360. Today we are going to know the number of valence electrons of carbon. So uh, I will teach you how to find out the number of valence electrons of carbon in three steps, right? If you follow these three steps that I am going to describe, you will be able to find out uh, valence electrons of more elements in the periodic table however let's get started in the first step we'll know the electronic configuration of carbon and then in the second step we have to find out the valence shell uh, by observing the highest value of principal quantum number and in the third step we'll calculate the valency electrons actually the valency electrons is the electrons of valence shell right however you know that uh, from the periodic table we know that uh, carbon has uh, six atomic number this means that carbon has six electron and six proton right now in the first step we'll write the electronic configuration of carbon right so carbon has six electron that is so we we have to uh, distribute this six electron electron in in the subshell or orbitals however you know that this is the above principle of writing electronic configuration by using this diagram we can write the electronic configuration of carbon okay so let me write that uh, we have six electron this means that the S electron, S subshell can take maximum 2 electron, P subshell can take maximum 6, D can take maximum 10, and F can maximum 14, right? S subshell has 1 orbital, P subshell has 3 orbital, that is Px, Py, and Pz, 3 orbital. D subshell has 5 orbitals, and F subshell has seven orbitals every orbitals can take maximum two electron right but these are the subshell however so our first two electron from this six electron will go will go to here that is one is two right and then the second two electron will go here two s two then we have another two electron so we have to put here two so this is the electronic configuration of carbon and now we'll we have to find out the valence shell so in the second step we'll find out the valence shell valence shell valence shell you can easily get valence shell by the highest number of n you know that one two these are the number of n that is principal quantum number so we'll look for the highest value of n so here the highest value of n equal to 2 that is this 2s2 and 2p2 is the valence shell of carbon so let me write the valence shell of carbon uh, 2s2 and 2p2 so this is the valence shell of carbon and in the third step third step what will you do will count the number of valence electron valency electron electrons right so uh, so 2s to 2p2 is the valence shell so the electrons of the valence shell is called is called valence electron so here we have 2 plus 2 that is 2 plus 2 that is 4 valence electron so now you can say that carbon has four valency electron right and <clears throat> this is the answer and i have a special blog post on the on the valency electrons of carbon you can read that blog post from the description box of this video so thank you for viewing this video be well